YouTube! I am Pinstar, and this is Rebuild 3 Strategy and Tactics Episode 5. So, um, the minute I hit the unpause button to save the game, yeah, a zombie mob appeared. These guys are fun. Uh oh, we spotted a huge mob of zombies. 70 of them at least. Huge and angry looking beasts. They're moving in a group like a river of undead. Not sure they even know we're here yet, but at the pace they're shuffling, they'll reach our walls in three days. So, yeah, these guys are somewhat like these guys. The difference is that they don't, they're not based on accumulated zombies, and they will shuffle to your base one, one space a turn, and, um, they don't care about the order of operations here, like these mobs do. They will attack when it's their time to attack. So you're going to have to deal with them and these guys at the same time. So this will be interesting. All right. So we just got a bunch more survivors, which is awesome. Do we have any goodies to give you? Sledgehammer, take it. That will give you some more defenses. Um, and we're going to need more food. I might actually, well, no, my scavenger guy needs to keep scavenging. You will get more food from active scavenging than you will farming. Um, and this guy is built for active scavenging. So we're just going to keep exploring and uh, scavenging here to try and get some goodies. Uh, and keep the food count high while we wait for our farms to come rolling in. He's almost done clearing the zombies there. Good. Why don't you, Mr. Engineer, uh, since I can't, um, you don't have, we don't have a workshop yet. You get started on building that. Um, you go and preach. You're retraining. You're holding off these zombies. You help him, because these guys are the next to attack. You help. Hmm. You help him. Did I make it more dangerous by adding him? Did I seriously make things more dangerous by adding him? What the heck? That makes absolutely no sense. Maybe they hate each other? I don't know. That is bizarre. All right, the huge farm doesn't have any goodies on it. Poop. Uh, my leader. Can my leader help you? All right, yeah, my leader actually helps. Why does uh, why does Mr. Four here? Oh, clumsy! You're clumsy. Ah, uh, really, really, really. Ah, uh, I might just turn you into a freaking farmer, Mr. Clumsy. All right, he is now zombie attack imminent. Well, it's a good thing that they're uh, imminently threatening this tile here. Uh, we're going to need every defender we can get. Uh, hopefully you guys finish up your kill mission here soon. Oh, and you didn't give me a chance on that one. Defend to our dying breaths. Let's try it. We dug in our heels, became a wall of meat and resolve. Not a single attacker made it past us. Phew! Wow, they that was they usually wait a little bit longer, but no, they were like, nope, we're going for you. Luckily, chance was in our favor. And our kill mission is successful. Tainted liquid. We do what we can to filter out the water we collect around town, but that does only so much. And Brian, DFL, stands or picked up some sickness. Damn it. But now we just have to worry about getting dysentery from drinking the water in these parts till those zombies rose up and the water treatment plant broke down. Now things could be a lot better if we get our control. So we got someone who is now injured, not sick. Well, not the worst person to be injured, although a pretty bad place for him to be injured. Oh yeah, now we build the hospital. You can't move them after the fact. That's that's annoying timing. Oh yeah, you gotta keep researching. Um Now I'm not doing zombie bait. Watchtowers wouldn't be a bad idea. 
Um, you, since this is all clear of zombies, start uh, start grabbing that rubble again. And then you, you keep. Yeah, we gotta we gotta we gotta fight for food here. Did we, um... Yes, there is stuff here. Good. Scavenge it. You know what? I'm gonna farm for a little bit. Just so we can get uh, some extra food production going. What's the, uh, 1%? Alright, you... That means you can go on a kill mission. You go on this kill mission right here. You're gonna need some help, though. We'll bring the low-level dude. There we go. Some on-the-job training, if you will. How how fast are we? Our point for two a day. It's a good thing I did that. Found materials, found food. Zed has become devout. Yeah, uh, when you go the church route, people uh, that will uh, that will start uh, spreading to other people, uh, which is actually makes your churches more effective. Um, it can be dangerous if you're up against the cultists, which is one of the NPC factions, but it doesn't look like they are going to be one of them. It looks like it's going to be the rotten and the government, um, which is fine. That means we can go religious and not have to worry about our people turning into cult members and killing themselves. Uh, right then, more exploring. We keep, keep going, dude. But I don't think we're going to have to worry about starvation. We are going to want to clear out some zombies from the workshop. Oop, trader. Big farm reclaimed. Lovely. Here, Mr. Engineer, help help us with the kill mission. And you go trade with the government. Survivor spotted. Nice. And I, actually, I can spare my guy now. No free houses. We need houses. All right then, we need more housing. That's we probably gonna have to reclaim that apartment and then the workshop once this, once this pile gets uh, offloaded here. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, materials. Ooh, weapons. Expensive weapons. Very expensive weapons. All these freaking sledgehammers. But the sledgehammers are good! They're two defense! That's as good as the pistol. The hunting rifle and the assault rifle are beautiful, but they're expensive. Let's try and haggle. 5% discount. Uh, since we are positive food, we can chuck all of our food. Um, it'd be silly to go to liquidate all our ammo, but... We've got enough here, and we're going to be getting a workshop soon, so... Boom! More weapons! Yeah, you can do better than a whip, buddy. Have an assault rifle. Uh, you can have a whip. Do I have any? No, I don't have any more geek items for you. Um, you... I actually want to keep him with the sledgehammer, because that gives you a more diverse uh, set of stuff. You have the hand-to-hand, -hand, so hunting rifle would... Uh, and you need that for the building. Uh, you need that for the scavenging. Hunting rifle going to go to waste on you. You want that. You want the chainsaw. Or you want the hunting rifle, rather. That's a better fit for you. Oh, there's survivors over there, too. Well, yeah, I definitely need houses here. Oh, here's something we can do. We can Now that we have a lot of materials, we can build freaking apartments on the rubble. I was checking the west wall with Bryant DFL. This guy can't catch a break. Um, uh, and started out shouting, Sophie, Sophie, and ran for the gate. There's nothing out there but zombies. I understand DFL recognized them. Caught up in the time, held them back. So he recognizes someone he knows. 
Um, we're gonna make him kill her, kill the zombie. Yeah, he's not happy about that, but he won't like you if you if you are the one that does the kill. Poor guy. All right, well at least he's back from being injured. That's red. I'll just put you on the stack. Zombies killed. Lovely. Actually, yeah, why don't you, glorious leader, start reclaiming that. Oop, oh, and we got a we got a chance to talk. Zed! Mr. Minigun! What you got for me, buddy? Firearms training. That counts as a firearm, yes it does! So plus one, so he's now at a twelve. Yeah. Yeah, he's good. Oh, you're back here. Go preach. We have happiness issues. And we built an apartment. Sweet. And we can build watchtowers now. Beautiful. Actually, why don't you start building us a watchtower here on this farm? It's going to be kind of a spearhead for us. Oop, and you, uh... Let's see. Eccentric first aid or crafter. We'll make you a crafter uh, and put the other guy in here once we, uh, once we get the workshop. We'll have him trade. But in the meantime... What do we get here? Uh, we're not using the school quite so much. Generator power. Not bad idea. Let's get generator power. Oh yeah, let's get our uh, scavenger here. Actually, in that case, we should... Now that we're starting to scavenge further and further in... Now we're... Gah. Now that we're scavenging further away, we want zombie avoidance. It helps reduce the, the uh, distance penalty. Because the further away you do missions from the fort, the more dangerous they all become. Hey, we're starting to get chatty chats all over the place here. Uh, firearms training. You have a firearm. Be trained in it. And I just realized Eric Flair can join up in the lab. Bunny Wunnies! I was out scavenging when we were found an old and abandoned pet store. The only survivors were a family of rabbits that had obviously figured out where the owners had kept the sacks of food. And what should we do with them? Keep them as pets, eat them, or half and half? Let's keep them as pets. We need happiness more than we need food right now. Rabbits for everyone! Plus one. That's usually stronger. Oh well. Finally! It took you long enough. Zero percent danger. Ooh, but these guys are uh, a little bit heavier hitting here. All right, we want one of you to start killing zombies, but the other one can start uh, reducing danger. And once he builds that guard post, that will actually help with uh, with protection of the area. And dangerous mass ed. Found ammunition. These are all hills. All right, you go explore this park. You can also go down there. But this little nook right here I want to sort of take for my whole self here. Upgrade complete. Nice. All right, what else can we upgrade for defense that makes sense? Yeah, we don't have any any defunct buildings really at the moment. Um, this one will help. See, once he's done with his kill mission, I'll uh, why don't you come down here and scout that? Once he's done with his kill mission, I'll move him up here to claim that. Actually, in that case, why don't you take over here? Hmm. Need a little protection. Oh, he's clumsy! God dang it! Can't believe that does. I hate that. Bad trait to have. Alright, well, who else can we. 
You know what? Seriously, I'm going to make him a scavenger and make him farm. Because I don't want that poison. I hate I hate turning a soldier into a not soldier, but this clumsy trait, he's got to be a farmer. Because there is no danger on farm. We'll, we'll tackle the yellow. We'll handle the yellow thing. we got a hospital in case someone gets hurt. Nope, and there he goes. Um, heal Jeb using medicine. We got plenty of medicine. All right, good. Now down to these guys. Guard duty. Down to you. All right, let's uh, see if I can spare somebody. Yep, they're good. Can I spare? No, I can't really spare two somebodies. Don't want to take it past. Don't want to take it past yellow. But yellow's okay. Wish I hadn't have sold that backpack. That would have been perfect for him. Regular rations, increased rations, or decreased rations. We're going to stick with regular for now. But once we start getting like an ultra surplus of food, then uh, then we can up it. Okay, we're going to have to start uh, start looting other places around here. You haven't scouted that yet. All right, less danger. Let's see. Uh, generator power, because then we can get to fertilizers. Oh, and another zombie horde. Hmm, do we want... And these two guys hate each other. The builder or the soldier? Yeah, we want the soldier. Yes, I know I could go after them with the, the higher level leader and get both, but we are already using our school right now, and yeah. Why don't you help out the danger levels here? And actually, you are going to get your freaking sledgehammer taken away. Kobe Chain Gun. Yeah, I know that's your name. You're not getting the chain gun yet, buddy. Have a chainsaw. Okay, let's, um... Oh, let's scout that place. It's got goodies. Uh, I need more room, because you you tend to get survivors in at least pairs. Um, so I don't want to tap that and not have room for two people. So we're going to need another thing, but we're about to get that. Um, defend our dying breath, and we're good. Splendid. Okay, good. Builder! Start reclaiming. You guys start clearing the zombies from the workshop, because that's going to be our next reclaim. Um, and yeah, you're, you're fine with that. Just the two of you. Is there something my, um... Well, you know what? I'll, uh... You defend. Hey, we already built that. I was about to say, is there another improvement I could build? No. Uh, you can go there. Let's do some more zombie killing. Uh, where else do we want to kill and claim? Let's... Yeah, that's as good as place as ever. The fewer sides of the buildings that you have touching, the better. Aha. And yeah, once you have a level 5 leader, we can ask him if he needs anything, and one of your goods will be worth double. He needs ammo. Eh, we're a little low on ammo. Uh, crowbar. I like them crowbars. For 15, not going to sell a sledgehammer. Not going to sell my ammunition, because we got too many gun-using people. Uh, bicycle, not so much. Toolbox, a second toolbox. Nah. We'll trade away our food since it's in the positive. Can we haggle? 
5% discount. Didn't do anything. That's okay. I'm okay with that. The crowbar is the only thing that goes in the item slot that can give you a bonus to combat. So it's good in that sense. Uh, where is our Pete? No, we don't want to... Yeah, we're not giving him that. We don't want to take away his backpack. Um... Yeah, you just gotta find... Yeah, see you! If I give you the crowbar, you get it a little bit stronger. Alright, well, this looks like a good stopping point here. So, um, if you like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback is always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar, signing out. See ya.